hello youtube welcome back to my video so uh, till my previous video i have shown how to create this login project from the scratch and uh, we have ended up uh, in creating uh, the login process and uh, the profile page and uh, logout process everything we have done it so let me login in and show you what our project is here it is we have given a small navigation this is home page and this is profile page and uh, this is my username and uh, just lo log out button so uh, this is a simple project the uh, login project now what i'm going to do is i'm going to add a css uh, to this project and make this uh, look beautiful okay so for that we'll have to search a uh, admin template because uh, this is an admin project means there is a uh, login process and profile management process uh, so, so let me search an admin template uh, similar admin template which we can use in our project so i have found a simple admin uh, template which is free of use uh, so i have just uh, saw the uh, live preview also here so there are different pages you can just uh, use it uh, free of course so let me download it from here this is the project i mean this is the admin uh, template i'll share the link of this template in the description now let us uh, open this and see what is there inside so uh, this is the dashboard this is the index page and one more page is the it's UI elements and uh, the blank page okay so these are the three pages uh, so all these are blank nothing is happening so only three pages here yeah that's enough for us to work on uh, the login project now let's uh, go on to include this in our project okay so come back uh, to the folder what are all the assets here css fonts image we don't need the font we need image and uh, the javascript and the css okay so let me uh, copy first the assets and uh, come to our project and in the web content we have to paste the assets all the assets which we are going to use so let me copy paste all that one and I am removing this uh, phone. We are not uh, going dealing with phone here. Let me remove it and delete it. So uh, let me copy uh, the pages also blank index and UI uh, dot HTML. Come to the web content and uh, paste it here. Okay. Now uh, let's uh, try running this uh, index dot HTML here and see what is coming yes it's loading perfectly now, uh, we have the profile page here my profile and home page here so what i'm going to do is i'm just replacing this home.jsp as home.1 and uh, copying this uh, index.html in this view and replacing this index.html has home to home.jsp so what I did is just uh, replace uh, the home page with uh, the new template okay so let me open this and show you here okay so this is the perfectly the new template which we have downloaded now now let's go to the project and if I'm refreshing this one and I believe we will have to know no need to restart uh, the project maybe we will restart because we have done a, a drastic big change here so let me restart the project again and now come back to the login screen now let me log in here and the password is one two three four five six and if i am submitting this one we'll see the home page as the new one but see here the css is not loaded at all so we have to do something to load the css here so what we have to do is we have to define uh, the css actually uh, this page you can see here here itself it's it's calling uh, this font awesome dots not this one uh, custom dot CSS it's calling the uh, assets CSS custom dot uh, it's not loading the CSS because it cannot find this path and uh, we are not uh, assigned uh, CSS in uh, web dot XML so we have to add a code or code of line in the uh, web dot XML to detect the css and the load css in uh, 
the JSP page. I got stuck here because I, when I created this pro project for the first time, the CSS was not loading in the project at all. So I have found the solution how to load that CSS in uh, the JSP page. So what we have to do is, so we have to design uh, the servlet mapping for the uh, CSS and uh, whatever the files which we are using uh, in the project. So I have uh, just mapped that uh, CSS as default and same uh, the .js fi file same way. Okay. Now getting back to the home.jsp and one more thing here we have not assigned uh, the path we have to assign the path same as this one like uh, login project so this is the base uh, uh, this is the base web web content folder uh, uh, till this one the web content folder of the project so let me paste it here and put a slash and if i'm opening from yes uh, the css is opening which means our path is correct now let's go to the servers and restart the server and uh, let's uh, try uh, starting uh, logging in our project again now let's open the project again going back to the login screen and put the username and password again and uh, submit it yes the css has uh, partially loaded uh, still we have to uh, get the path correctly again here so now so we have added uh, the complete path here but this path belongs to uh, this project uh, in my pc so if i am uh, deploying this one this one in a website or in an, any other project the path may be different so going to the each page and changing the path is uh, more difficult so what we can do for an easiest way is go to the uh, bean class and uh, i'm just creating a new class here common and inside that common class i'm going to create a small a static variable which can be accessed from all uh, pages so it will be like public static url is equal to and we are going to give uh, the path of our project till uh, the base path okay till the web content folder here okay so what we can do is okay public static fine we have uh, put it as public static string url so from the home page i can call directly it as till this one give a common things here it like common dot url so we have set uh, the path correctly it will take the path from here so if you are changing the path or if you are changing the project link you can just uh, update here so it will be affected in all the places of the path which we are using so here we are using here we are using the href is there and one more was the dot js file so it may be down yeah here it is in assets js here it is also we are using that now come back to the page and if i'm refreshing the page again no we have to uh, restart the server to affect that completely so i have restart the server again come back to the login page refresh it now if i'm uh, logging in here again two three four five six and submit yes uh, we have successfully uh, incorporated all css in this uh, page and you can see here all the css is there now we have to do uh, the modification of that uh, tabs and uh, uh, make this uh, with the uh, integrated completely with our project okay so this is our left side bar where we can add our path completely uh, the links here and the logout button is here and we'll give the name here okay so going back to the project here and uh, uh yeah here is the link we don't want all, all this link we are removing all this link so we have all, all uh, only these uh, three uh, links here so we will be updating with uh, the data with uh, our old page come back to the home one dot the jsp where we have our links completely here so let me uh, copy
so uh, copying this link completely and going to home.jsp what is the dashboard included so I'll remove this included uh, included word from here and we'll give our link here and uh, name as uh, home and same way so the link I'm just copying this again same way I'm putting it here okay so uh, it will be uni uniform in all cases okay now we have uh, let me copy three times this one and uh, remove this completely and from home one let me copy the profile come back to here as profile and uh, the logout here come back to here as logout and the path again slash uh, sign out controller it's uh, slash sign out controller and in profile uh, user profile okay it's a user profile here and uh, yeah we have the name here so let me copy here like welcome get username so in the dashboard let me copy uh, same thing here welcome and uh, the name same name here also okay yes we have done the preliminary modification so uh, let me log in and see what is our modification happened here oh, wait two three four five six yes we have to do one more thing we have not imported the common.url just uh, import that completely yes now i guess it will be okay now login bin also we have to import okay yes we have imported both here now let's uh, refresh this page again and see yes we can see here the home on profile and logout button is here and my name is coming here again the username is coming here so logout button we should give it here we'll uh, if i'm good clicking profile page it should go to profile page and if i'm clicking home page it should come back to the home page okay yes now let me give uh, the logout button here and uh, the same page i am putting uh, the profile page also let me copy that uh, copy paste the same thing in profile page also now let me uh, keep this as one and uh, here in the profile in the home page i am same page copying it as uh, my profile okay my profile okay same page i'm putting as my profile okay now uh yes we have to change that logout button from here and uh, let me remove this link and they coming back to here okay i have put the logout button here and uh yeah same way copying this one and in the my profile dot jsp same way let me remove this logout button and uh, paste it here okay now let's uh, go to the home page again let's see yes i have removed that logout button you can see down the link sign out controller is coming here and the profile if i'm going to profile page this is the profile page okay now if i'm logging out so it will be log out okay so we have uh, uh, in we have added the CSS uh, to the pages uh, inside this now let me uh, create a small sign in form also so I have completed uh, designing uh, the index page as well uh, the index one dot is the uh, the primary one which uh, without any uh, CSS and I have added uh, index dot JSP with uh, some CSS added you can see I have added a uh, style dot CSS and index dot CSS only for my uh, login form now let's see how this looks so as you can see here it is all changed from that uh, prim uh, primary thing to the, this design form actually what I have done is I have downloaded a uh, 
a login form here this one and i have just incorporated in our project so if i'm clicking logging in the message is coming here okay now let me log in with my username and password and see how it is inside yes here you can see we have all our designed uh, a profile page and home page i have not uh, deleted other things you can see if i'm logging out uh, it is uh, coming back to the login page this design login page so that's all for now uh, i have uh, shown you how to add css from the beginning to a jsp project if you have any doubt in this uh, please comment below i'll be helping you and uh, i'll share all the source code in my description you can have it and please like and subscribe for my videos and thanks for watching